We have man of the match, Jason right here. Jason, before I even delve into your performance, you tell me how do you think your performance was? Well, um, first, I just want to thank God, um, definitely my Lord and my Savior, Jesus Christ, for, for carrying me and, uh, and both teams um, injury-free throughout the game. Um, you know, it was a favorable result for us, and I think overall my performance was just what the team needed. Um, you know, I equalized and I helped the team in, in, in a lot of the build-up play. So I think overall my performance was, was a solid one. As you talk about the team, the team now back-to-back -back wins, you're out of the relegation zone. How is that feeling for you right now? And what are your future aspirations for this team? for this season? As you know, it's a long season. Um, we have a lot more games, and I think the most important thing um, for us is to keep our heads down and keep working, and the sky is the limit. You know, we don't put any limit on what this season holds for us. We're just working hard, and we're just leaving everything else in God's hands. We know not only the team, but you, you have had a tough start to this season. How important is this goal today and having more, more better performance along the way? Yeah, um, definitely. Um, as an attacking player, goals really um, spike um, some level of confidence and just some level of momentum um, in any player. So um, definitely, I will be um, you know, working on um, the same way and hopefully you know, I can carry along um, a good form um, throughout the rest of the season. How much, I don't know if it's true, but how much do you believe in this Malines team? Like how far you personally think you can go and how much do they align with your ambitions as a player? Well, um, I think we have the, the quality um, definitely to go um, as far as to the end of the season. Um, but you know, um, it takes a lot more um, than quality. It takes um, a high level of commitment and especially um, because of the length of the season and how much games now, um, it takes you know, a complete um, effort from the administrative staff, the coaching staff and, and the players. You know, discipline is going to be a key, key factor in how we finish the season and you know, those are some of the stuff that we'll have to work on um, just to, to have a, a productive season. Final question, Jason, because we know you have to go. You're very busy. We want to know if they, what difference do you think for the past two games now, different from the rest of the season now? Anything different in the coaching, tactics, anything that, you know, to get the better out of your play? Because even though you never scored last match, your performance was superb. And now you come, you cap it off today with a goal. I think um, as a team, we, we realized that the position that we were in, we didn't deserve it in terms of the quality we have and, and some of the games that we lost. Um, so, you know, we took a deep look and we actually just get going in terms of just work hard, just putting our heads down and working hard. And I think it's paying off now. And, you know, going into the Christmas and into the New Year's, I think it's the right time for, for picking up a, a, a momentum. And I think it will do us a lot. Um, going forward into the, the second half of the season. All right. Congratulations again for being the man of the match. I wish you all the best for the rest of the season. And also congratulations on coming out of relegation. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Thank man. you.